question from Yana. Hello, I have a question to ask. How would a Jewish Orthodox girl like me, like myself, be able to continue her way of being a from Jew in a secular environment, specifically in a university or community college where there are so many people who are against our religion and who are still trying to find their own paths? How do I stay strong in the face of all this? Well, many people face that challenge, whether it's university, whether it's in the, in the job market, people where they're employed, uh, maybe we're living in, in different uh, cities where uh, different sections where the non-Jewish uh, uh, neighborhood, and uh, they're faced uh, with this uh, uh, question, how do they stay strong in the Judaism if all around them it's a secular kind of anti-Jewish uh, environment? Uh, but number one, we give them a, a, the, the best uh, uh, advice to put themselves in a Jewish environment the best they can, and uh, they won't have this problem so much. But when the person, for whatever reason, they are in that environment, they have to keep, keep a connection to Torah, to Judaism, through a mentor, through a teacher, through a rabbi, through a rabbitson, somebody that they feel close to, to be in touch with them, to discuss, to ask their questions, and to uh, get constant uh, chizah, constant uh, uh, help and uh, encouragement from people who are uh, strong in the Judaism. And if they'll keep a, their, their, their lifeline, they'll keep a commun communication with those type of people, they'll keep them strong, and they won't be uh, falling to uh, uh, the environment, environment around them, which is anti-Jewish. But if a person who doesn't have that connection they're in very big danger because the, uh, uh, the force of people around them, like Maimonides discusses, the way of a person, God created people to be, we discussed it many times, we quoted the Maimonides, the derech of the way of the world is the people to be influenced by their society, by their environment, and you can't get away from it. And if the Rambam gives a person the, uh, uh, the, the obligation to remove himself from such an environment because if he doesn't, He's going to soon let it be in, in influenced by it. So we have to try to keep, put ourselves in the right environment. If we find ourselves not in the right one, we still have to keep in contact with the right environment, with the right people to keep us, keep us going and keep us on the right path. Today, especially, it's much easier than it used to be with the technology today. We can keep in touch with people by telephone, by, by, uh, by all kinds of means of communication and keep us going uh, in, this, in the right path. Don't be scared, don't be scared.